as it is often the case when you write a book, you talk about yourself. So also this book is quite biographical. Um, I always been dreaming of becoming an academic. And when I became a professor, I realized that that job was not really taking my full potential. And I start wondering why it was so. Well, my scientific articles are read by very few people, my books even less. My students will retain very little of what I say. So you need to be very humble about the impact you have in society. And I start wondering how many people feel the same. Doctors, engineers, professionals, communicators, uh, at all level of society, they probably feel like me. They feel that they have much more to give to society than what society allows them to do. We are a bit constrained in our job description. And as soon as I came to the realization that I was a bit in a cage, I not only decided to reinvent my job and my role in society, but I also tried to inspire many other people. And in order not to fall victim of the usual trap, so just writing a book, I also decided to set up an organization, a community of mainly volunteers, citizens experts, that is called the Good Lobby, that tries to strengthen the ability of civil society to gain a voice into the process and to counter undue influence exercised by the usual suspects, mainly companies, organized interests, who are not necessarily representative of all the interests in society.